Now, I also went down to the police department to try and correct it with Officer Martin first, and then I sued him, right? Two. Mm -hmm. And I don't know what's wrong with that man, but he was not at the accident scene until later on, and even if he observed everything, I was still in the correct place <laughs> for it to be her fault. Right? And I don't know what the bus driver convinced him of, but she had to be the one to convince him I was in the wrong when it was her. Mm -hmm. To not even take down my statement, right? That's what I mean, right? So you're not looking at it from the point of view from what I saw, but from what she thought, right? And she's coming up to the intersection and going through the late yellow light. <laughs> you know what I mean, All right? I'm the one who knows I need to yield right away if I like turning yellow, so I stop. <laughs> And why do you think I keep going over it with you, Officer Martin? You wrote the accident and put me at fault. <laughs> I was not at fault. She could have gone straight and not hit me. I know. <laughs> it's what I mean. It's what I'm trying to explain to you. I was doing it right. You can't make everything on my fault either, not about her daughter either. either. <laughs> I can't control it if she comes in there to me. All I know is to bring her back to her. <laughs> no matter what I'm making up or don't remember happening, I don't remember it happening, but she can't do that either, either. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And she can't know. <laughs> The dad can't know. No one can know what happened but me and the daughter if she's with, there with me at all. Right? And she can't embellish what she did or didn't see. And the only way she could is if she's illegally recording me and her, which goes to entrapment. Mm -hmm. And the reason it's entrapment is I'm not trying to do nothing with the girl, but what I would do with my younger sister when I was helping to raise her. And it sure as hell wouldn't be nothing sexual. <laughs> mm -hmm. But she can't elicit your help now. After all this time, and I don't even know what the hell's going on, right? Which is true amnesia. Right? And she has no evidence I even had sex with her, right? At all, at all. <laughs> it can't even exist. <laughs> And I guarantee you, before I met Daphne, I would never touch your daughter no matter what you did. <laughs> but it's not a crime, right? If I'm trying to help her pee and she don't go pee, and then I have to make sure she didn't pee. Like I said, you gotta spell it if it's a female, right? To make sure she didn't pee herself or something, right? It's the only reason she wouldn't go to the bathroom. <laughs> but I didn't know if she did or didn't either. And the hypothetical I'm creating, I'm not sure what happened, right? Based on my interaction with her or any girl her age, first off, I know she's not supposed to be in there with me at all, but depends on what she's doing, right? In there with me too, right? 
But like I said, if she rubs her crotch in my face, I might still think she needs to be. Uh oh, uh oh. And see, I don't know nothing about shooting any video with nobody, with nobody ever, with a child, <laughs> mm -hmm. sexual or otherwise, <laughs> or helping her get in the bathroom. <laughs> Well, like I said, I talk about someone stealing my identity even then. <laughs> right? <laughs> I don't know. Because, see, I'm, I'm one of the crazy Christians who don't know when not to help someone out. Like one of the guys on my ship who asked to borrow the car when our ship went out to see a lady borrow it. And, see, I'm such a trusting fellow I didn't know what was really going on <laughs> but what was really going on is he was going AOL uh, absolutely without leave A W L yeah AWOL AWOL <laughs> and see I'm I'm not by that time I'm <laughs> not myself either right? <laughs> I'm not thinking logically right Mm -hmm. And then I lost the check, or no, which is for over thirteen thousand dollars, right? And I think I lost it in the cab that brought me to the apartment. You know? All right. And someone bought a car. I think. I think it was um, either a Oldsmobile or a Buick, something similar to my mom. Sorry. If I remember correctly, because I called him and asked what this was all about, right? But that was why I got arrested in Port Wentworth with the heart and all that problems, right? Shortly after I had the congestive heart failure, because I was probably going to my mom's, right? When y'all arrest me for that thing, right? I don't know, but she shouldn't have any video with me and her daughter, right? And the only way she could do that is what? <laughs> Make it herself. <laughs> but just making the video alone, is that a crime? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know but... See, if the girl even went up it went in there to me at all. I don't know. And she's editing it somehow. Mm -hmm. That's on her. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but I know this. You don't ever try to have sex with a child on a video. And the only way I can be with a woman is if she's over 18 and consents to the video. Right? That's all I know about it, dude. Right? But I know you can't even shoot a video of a child naked and even remotely acting sexual with their stepdad or any man. That's kiddie porn. That has zero tolerance. <laughs> right. Now, it would be odd, though, <laughs> that in 94, mm -hmm. if she had a video... Mm -hmm. Is she presented then too, or is this something now? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Plus, I didn't talk about it till I wrote the blogs that got on different uh, video upload sites like iFilms, um, Live Video, or I think that's what it was called, yeah. and uh, Stick Cam <laughs> with Molly Z. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Sean, if you look at the it changes the landscape. It runs for 29 years. And you talk about so many groundbreaking things that have never been talked about on television before. Were there times you were nervous because it was so unprecedented? Well, I... You know, we're from Dayton, Ohio, and that's a crossroads of America, and uh, our first guest was Madeline Murray O'Hare, the most hated woman in America. She was the one who uh, got the Supreme Court to declare.
decreed that the reading of prayer in a public school was unconstitutional. Well, you know, Mad Madeline Murray O'Hare comes on our show and she says, there's no God, there's no heaven, there's no hell. When you die, you go into the ground, you biodegrade, and you become a part of the physical universe. Well, the building fell in in Dayton, Ohio. Couldn't, people couldn't believe what they were seeing. But boy, did the rating, the ratings were as never before seen. I think you really changed the world. And when you look at any history of television, it's you that were the first to uh, reveal what us human beings do have an appetite for and are willing to... But could she make one? I don't know. All she needs is a picture of me and her daughter. Right. To do so. I don't know. That. And from 2005 till now, how many videos have I put up? Mm -hmm. But people are editing me into other videos. I don't know. Even Taylor Swift videos, right? I never did that shit. <laughs> no. I <don't> know. <laughs> And with today's editing, right, which I don't even know how to do yet, <laughs> right. Which just aired its first episode with many more to come. We'll be right back. One of the things that I want Mike, I've asked Mike Floor to do for me, is one day for him to explain it to the boys. Also coming from a male dad to a male child. I wanted to come, not that I won't tell the kids, I told the kids, they didn't want to know more. Mm -hmm. No mystery, it's going to happen. I might see it, nobody likes it when their check engine light comes on, especially when your car's out of warranty. That can mean expensive repair bills. That's why I have Car Shield. They get expensive car repairs taken care of, so I don't have to. You got to love that. Having Car Shield's the next best thing to having factory warranty. We chose Car Shield because we didn't want to get stuck with expensive car repairs. Mm -hmm. well, that's a is, hey, this is a family meeting. Dad, you know that every month you need to put money in this account. So then we know. But you can let the truth confuse you, but you still have a choice, but you can also change your mind, but it's also how the other person feels if you're doing something or not, and that's what you've got to all take into consideration here, right? But that's the whole point. My stepdaughter has been raised by her mother all her life, right? I only knew her less than four days, if, if that, right? I don't remember all the details either. Here. Just certain details, like anybody. I can't tell you what we ate <laughs> or stuff like that, right? You know? Or what me and Daphne ate that week or what TV programs I was watching either, either. <laughs> That's usually what we an average family does. They go home, fix a meal, right? watch TV till a certain time, and I went to the couch and slept on the couch and we didn't shoot their bedroom, right? Why would she even be worried that her daughter would come in there to meet me either? <laughs> she shouldn't have been, right? I'm on the couch. I'm staying away from her. So that means when her daughter got there, she could sleep with her, right? <laughs> right, right. Uh oh, man's going after the teen sister. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Jacob, watch out, boy. <laughs> Giving people bad ideas. <laughs> Even with the woman and her sister. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Uh oh. So before we meet Shakira, take a look at the message she had for you, Mary. Watch this. Now let's see. Mary, you are so young. You are a great man, but now you are human with a penis. Men like Tommy are hard to find. Uh oh, the pancakes what did it for her, huh? <laughs> it don't sound like she likes him as well, does it? No. <laughs> yeah, it does actually, right? And that ain't even his baby she take you take care of at any rate. Yeah. But like I told you about Richard Pryor, I for an eye two for a tooth and baby for a baby. <laughs> Where he played the preacher. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there wouldn't be a show if there wasn't women like that. <laughs> there wouldn't be a show. Well, I thought a guy working at the um, Popeyes kind of looked like Phil Donahue. Told you all that too, right? I think. Tolerate each other, you tolerate each other. That's another thing. To make a marriage last, you should sleep tushy to tushy. <laughs> so, I mean, we got a lot of good advice. Should, should it be a, so what we learned <laughs> but the but, but, but. <laughs> on these double dates was that people who made it, both people, <laughs> I personally really love. But. If you got a video evidence, okay, <laughs> and this happened in 94, right? you don't sit on it till I get on YouTube where I say I could have molested her in the blog but didn't. <laughs> that's not when you bring that out. <laughs> I know that's not. You bring it out shortly after, at least before I fell, fall on base, right? <laughs> And then you can prove it, right? <laughs> exactly. Exactly, right? I don't even know there's a video. There shouldn't be a video right? involved with this at all, right? I don't know. Unless you're trying to what? Orwell. <laughs> and see, when you put someone in an awkward situation, both me and the child will not normally interact with each other. As we would if she really had to use the bathroom or not, too, right? I mean, I don't know if she would have even involved me, right? right? Ordinarily, unless she felt she needed help, right? Going to the bathroom. Um, and see, editing something together don't prove nothing. No, no. Because, <laughs> see, I don't, I have to guess what you got. <laughs> Based on what I know about movies and editing. <laughs> Shit together, right? See, I do know if you had real proof I did something with my stepdaughter, I wouldn't be talking to you now. <laughs> or ever. Or ever. <laughs> I'd already be in jail, right? Or not. Unless it's something you're not sure of yourself that looks kind of odd how it suddenly is in the scene, right? Now, a scene, though, if you're in real life, okay, <laughs> has a start, right, to an ending, right, and that's all it can have. It can't be broken in pieces, right, of shooting that video. <laughs> see, if the child's in there with me at all, first you got to see me either go over to her or her come over to me, right, right. That's the first shot you should see, right. 
Then from there, mm -hmm. based on what I know about editing or not, right? Based on movies or not, right? <laughs> okay, it goes from there. Now, if she's closer to the bathroom, I'm going over there because I look. Thank you, ladies. I'm going to the bathroom. Especially if she's stirring you and you're sleeping there on the couch. Right. right. And then you go over there to assist her. Right. Because you think she needs help going to the bathroom. Right. So then, since she's in more in the living room with you, you got to pull off her pants. And she can't walk to the bathroom. Toilet, actually, not the bathroom itself, but the toilet. <laughs> now, I don't know exactly what's going on, but I also don't see my ex wife if I'm doing all that. <laughs> so I think she's in there with me by myself, staring at me while I'm asleep on the couch. So I, of course, assume she what needs to be. Needs to be. <laughs> then I would go over there to assist her. Now, the first thing you do is you pull off her panties. <laughs> And as soon as her panties are off, she should go walk to the toilet. <laughs> there should be no delay in that either. She's got to pee. Right? Right? <laughs> then if she sticks around, I got to figure out, well, what's going on now? Right? right? <laughs> the only other thing I can do is check to see if she already peed. Right? So I lay her on the ground to see if she already peed, right? And then I smell her crotch, right? Because with a female, you got to smell, right? With a male, you don't. They could <laughs> on anything, even you. <laughs> even if I'm asleep on someone else's couch, a boy child will just pee on me and say, fuck the toilet. <laughs> the girls, usually when they potty train, go to the toilet only on me. <laughs> They know that too, right? <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. And this is breaking it down for you, fellas, right? If you don't see all of this in the video, say it to somehow, right? <laughs> right? Someone don't want you to see certain parts of the video because it would incriminate them more than me, right? <laughs> mm. Now, to see if she peed, though. How I would entertain my sister, me and my stepbrothers, is we would sometimes do the mm. <laughs> right? So then you would stick out your tongue and go down and come back up. Once. Once. Now, <laughs> that's not how you do oral sex. No, it's not. No, it's not. <laughs> I know. That's how you check to see if she didn't pee, right? <laughs> One time, right? <laughs> And you only do it once. Right? Now, after that, okay, if you smell her and you think she maybe peed a little, you might think the other reason is to take a shower. Right. So then you go and undress because you're not sure. A, she's still in there with you alone and you don't see her mother. And she's been laying there for a little while now. <laughs> If she's comfortable taking a shower with you, <laughs> like I remember doing with my mom when I was around her age myself, right? So I got to see, like I told you about the little girl, mm -hmm. who I inappropriately showed my penis to by a tree outside, right? <laughs> so I know I'm in privacy of my own apartment, right? Exactly, exactly. So I'm going to undress to see if I were to take a shower with her. Mm -hmm. Is that normal, right? Can she handle it? Has she ever taken a shower with another man? Or would it bother her? Mm -hmm. It's like the guy on the airplane saying, have you ever seen a grown man naked? Well, that's what you got to determine. If she would be comfortable taking a shower with you or not, right? And I'm still making it up. I don't remember this even happening, right? But that's what you would have to do right there. Mm hmm Now, if she's still laying there on the floor acting like it don't bother her, you then have the option to do the shower or not. I wouldn't even do the shower with her. I would stop and get dressed. Right? Why? 
Because Daphne's there in the shower will wake her up. <laughs> that way. Her mom's right there in the next room of her. So then I'm going to get dressed. Right? I'm going to dress her. Right? I'm going to ask her who showed her this. Right? This is the part they don't want you to see if I ask her who showed her that. Because there's only one person she can answer if I'm doing something similar to her, that. Grandma or grandpa or even dad. Right? And stepmom. Right? The only other people who could do this with her besides me or my ex-wife is the biological dad or the grandparents. They're the only one the child is around, right? That's all I can say about it, too, right? That's all I know about it, right? And anything more, I'm still saying this is all I could have done to a certain point anyway, right? Taking it from her coming out of the bathroom, I mean the bedroom, me thinking she needs to go to the bathroom, her not going to what I would do is a consequence if she didn't go, right? And it would not be broken up into multiple shots or different shots either. It would be her come in there, wake me up. I'd see her in there with me. I'd go over to her, right? And the alternative is she came over to me and they don't want you to see that either, right? <laughs> it woke me up. They don't want you to see something in the shot if they leave any part of the shot out. Mm-hmm. It's questionable to them, right? But it's not so questionable mm -hmm. that you can convict me on it alone, right? <laughs> or you would, or you would. <laughs> I know that's what you're saying too, right? <laughs> but I'm not the one who don't understand, even though I'm a step-parent, just like a step-mom. <laughs> and yes, I do know sometimes the step-dad is the villain there, right? But I also had Lisa Baker. <laughs> As he being Lisa Baker, friend, only did oral. <laughs> that I recall. Mm -hmm. No full sex, right? Now, did I have it near her? Yes. But did I go inside of her? I don't believe so. I don't believe so. She was still resisting me enough that I would not penetrate her. And she made me feel awkward about it. <clears throat> so I was on the outside, but never went on the inside of her body, right? Because <laughs> I feel like she's resisting me, and I don't rate when you don't rate. I don't put it in if I don't feel like you want to in <laughs> with anybody, with anyone. <laughs> especially a female, especially a female. <laughs> Now, I'm not trying to even get her dad in trouble, but that's what I was told. That he had molested her. You know? So, it's hearsay. I'm not testifying for what happened between her and her dad or not either. either. That's why I heard. That's also why I wouldn't do nothing but legal things with my stepdaughter. Being that I'm her stepdad. Is, even in the Huggies commercial where the Dad is on the second baby taking a shower with the baby. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Damn. And just get naked in front of a child ain't enough to be a decent exposure if you're in the privacy of the living room either. You know? It's still in the privacy of the home. Right? And I know not to distribute anything of a sexual nature with the child anyway or it's child pornography. That's right, ain't it? I know it is. Mm-hmm. That you would also only do it once. A loop is created when you do the same act over and over again. Like this. <laughs> That's not how I was taught to do that. With anyone, you're performing no or take something, right? No. <laughs> I told you how you really do it is the ABCs <laughs> and one, two, threes. <laughs> Even me. And I was told differently about how you do the, the Taurus. 
Some say you do it last. Some say you do it first or whatever. You know, that's what we're girls into. That's what you do. Right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know. But we need to grow up and quit denying we're sexual creatures too when we are. When we are. <laughs> that ain't helping us deal with whatever the hell our problem is with sex. <laughs> and we all got an issue with it. <laughs> and I think it usually involves us crazy step parent or relative who wants to have sex with a child. <laughs> and don't know they're not supposed to, right? <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> They're not supposed to. They're not supposed to. They don't know that, right? But he also knows if you can prove it was him, you would have done the rest of you. Yeah, yeah. And you never touched her, and I never touched her, and I never. Really. <laughs> so I am on the couch. I can create and, you know, a something imaginative myself. <laughs> but it starts with her waking me up if I'm on the couch, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But, see, even if she just came in there to me, you can edit it to something worse, right? Yes, that's the point, right? You know that, too. You know that, too. 15, I believe. And that's the point about someone setting up a younger girl and telling her my no means yes or my yes means no, <laughs> So I don't know what to say to her. <laughs> but that's still them who would have to get her here. I don't leave my house at night. And even if I do, like if I go up to the um, Huddle House or the Waffle House, right, that's all I do. <laughs> then I go home, right? That's if I get hungry in the middle of the night or something. <laughs> when it used to be 24 hours. Right. <laughs> Right. Mm -hmm. But see, they're trying to get me in trouble, and I don't even know why. Uh -huh. But you think it might have to do with the younger daughter dreaming she's one of the two witnesses? Yeah, yeah. Mm hmm. And she was only four. She was only four. But, mm -hmm. when they pulled whatever the hell they were trying to pull <laughs> to see if I was gay or not, that didn't work. That didn't work. <laughs> I just started trying to find a girlfriend that would go all the way with me who was of age, who was of age. And the girls were all over 18. <laughs> the women, you know, whatever you want to call them now. <laughs> Ladies, right? I know all the positions, I know, even in the Karma Sutra, but I don't typically use but three. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now, here's another question. If a child is on top of the meal, mm -hmm, did they edit it to see if I'm blacked out mm -hmm, or they're using the stand-in mail, they're going to block you from seeing his face, right? Or his eyes, right? Like in the Clockwork Orange and even in the movie with Michael Caine where his son was kidnapped, they put toothpicks in your eyes to hold them up. Mm -hmm. Right? Remember that? <laughs> yeah, I know. 
That's another reason I don't judge children. <laughs> I know there's a consequence for that. <laughs> I ain't that crazy. <laughs> That's what you mean. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and, uh, they even touched a girl. They even touched a girl. Oh, no. <laughs> Sexually, don't mean I wasn't smell her crotch to make sure she's staying in front of me. She didn't pee, right? And even then, that's just doing her how you would change your diaper, smelling her once and coming back up quickly. Mm -hmm. I know that. Now, if you were to do that, you would go up and down where though. No. You wouldn't go all the way up, then go all the way back down, and go all the way up, and go all the way back down. <laughs> That's wasted energy for oral sex with a job or any woman. <laughs> any woman. You stay down there, right? <laughs> I can't show you again why you're not a woman to know. <laughs> Only the women I was with, and, uh, from the girl at Shay's party, right? Two. Mm hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Molly Z mm -hmm. knows how I have sex, right? <laughs> now, I didn't get to perform oral on Molly Z, but she was still on top, right? Yeah, yeah. But I did play with her boobs, right? <laughs> Two. <laughs> yes, it did. Yes, it did. Mm -hmm. But most of them, I don't know. <laughs> Including Sheena, I did some tongue action, right? But I don't, again, if I go up, I go up to your facial area. Mm -hmm. Not bob my head up and down like a yeah. <laughs> no, no. You never do that. You never do that. There's no reason to do that. If you're performing oral sex on anyone, no, no, no. <laughs> you can ask my aunt's wife about that. <laughs> I did it with her once too. I don't know what the tarot card reader did with us, <laughs> but she brought her over if we did so. <laughs> but if she did erase my memory, she knew by then she could erase my memory too, right? I don't know what's going on when I'm asleep, right? And as far as I know, uh, she left with Daphne and came with Daphne, right? I don't know she did anything with me, right? And I'm not worried about it, right? <laughs> we were still kind of in between our apartment then, too. It was between... Um, we met February, and we had the apartment, by, I think, by April. Mm -hmm. I don't know. So it was sometime during that time, right? But like I said, I can't tell you daily activities that are mundane or you don't remember sticking out to you. <laughs> no one can do all that. <laughs> That's normal memory loss too, right? But something that sticks out, right? You kind of remember that or not, right? And even then, if you have amnesia from a bump on your head or do you... <laughs> That can make you forget something someone else remembers too, but that's it. That's it. <laughs> and like I said, that's all I can point out to you could have happened, right? With my wife right the hell there. Okay. 